<laughs> he is a graphic designer, yes, and he's really good at it. He does like massive rebranding campaigns for large corporations. He gets flown all over the world doing this shit, right? About four years ago, a woman hired Morgan to rebrand her florist business, and he did such a great job, she married him. And he thought everything was just fine, until about three months ago, Morgan had to do a presentation in Sydney, right? But he was on his way home from overseas and he got stuck in Dubai due to a flight cancellation. So rather than cancel the meeting, Morgan suggested to these businessmen in Sydney that they do a Skype chat because he's so technologically savvy despite his fucking baffling text message style. <laughs> So Morgan checks into a hotel, cracks open his laptop and starts Skyping with this room full of businessmen in Sydney who are all watching Morgan on a massive screen on their boardroom wall, right? And everything's going great. Morgan is totally nailing it until about halfway through, he realises that a file he wants to show these dudes is on the desktop of his home computer back in his home office in Melbourne. And he decides to live share the desktop of his home computer on the Skype chat. He knows how to do that. He can control his computer remotely from anywhere in the world. It's not particularly new technology, but Morgan makes it sound so impressive. So this room full of businessmen are all watching keenly like, oh, Margaret, bring in some biscuits. There's some newfangled shit going on in here. <laughs> As Morgan clicks a few buttons and brings up the desktop of his home computer on the Skype chat. Now, what Morgan doesn't realise is that his wife has been using the photo booth app on that particular computer to take pictures of herself. To take naked pictures of herself. To take naked pictures of herself doing some pretty fucked up shit. <laughs> it's embarrassing to say the least. Just as Margaret came back in with the biscuits, I've got you the... <laughs> Those of you who are familiar with the Photo Booth app will know that how it works is it accesses the built-in camera in your computer and with a click of a button, takes a photo of you when you're standing in front of the screen. And if you know that, you'll also know that if you leave that application open, the camera also stays open, witnessing whatever may be happening in front of the computer in real time. Such as your wife, in your home office, fucking your best mate. goes on to tell me she's keeping the house, his former best mate is moving in, and while they're out for the day happily shopping for fittings, Morgan must suffer the indignity of moving his shit out and selling the stuff they don't want on Gumtree to this guy. Oh. 